Religions have been a symbol of harmony, peace and freedom since time immemorial, especially the release of a white dove or a white pigeon by our beloved Nehruji on his birthday has been symbolizing freedom for a long, long time. But when it comes to respiratory patients or lung transplant pulmonologists, pigeon could be the rue of someone's life. It could imprison them for life or put them on lifelong oxygen because it causes a restrictive lung disease called hypersensitivity pneumonitis. Hi. I am Dr. Tapasvi Krishna, Transplant Pulmonologist at Glen Eagles Hospital, Slepni Kapoor. Let's find out how pigeons can be your worst enemy in spite of being a symbol of love, peace and harmony. Pigeon feathers and pigeon droplings can be a source of allergens which cause something called as hypersensitivity pneumonitis in many patients. Hypersensitivity pneumonitis tends to harden the lung and make it impossible for patients to breathe. So we might be thinking that there are a lot of patients or people who house pigeons, feed pigeons every day and nothing happens to them. But the one odd person, one in 10 people who are exposed to pigeon antigens land up with someone like us, that's a transplant pulmonologist. When they develop hypersensitivity symptoms, symptoms very, very close to bronchial asthma, they could be having cough, tightness of the chest, or chronic shortness of breath, which is caused by pigeon antigens causing the lung to harden up. So these diseases can be treated with medication, but when the patient becomes progressively dependent on oxygen, and his oxygen requirement keeps going up, that is when the person might need a lung transplantation. That's the reason why we have to be very wary of keeping pigeons and around the house and let them breathe or stay on the air conditioning outlets around the house. So be wary of pigeons, keep your peace and harmony to yourself and avoid pigeons. Glen Eagles Hospitals, where good people make you feel better.